Hey, I just got a cool email from Willow and I had heard rumblings that they were coming out with a new pump and they have. So it's actually my birthday today. So thank you Willow for a wonderful surprise on my birthday. But anyway, I wanna show you a little bit about this pump. I've had a quick look at it and it's actually pretty cool. I will be getting one um, as soon as I can. I don't work directly with companies so I am not usually the first one to get their pumps. But I actually prefer it that way because I am not affiliated with a lot of these companies. I do like to get discount codes and um, so I have affiliate links for many of them, but I don't actually work for companies like this or partner with them usually. So um, I will get it as soon as I can and then I can give you a really unbiased review, especially based on a bunch of these other pumps <laughs> that we like to talk about, right? I have a few new pumps sitting here on my desk um, that I will show you soon as well. But let's check out the new Willow Go, okay? So the first thing I noticed was all of these sizes. This is awesome. A big thing about the Willow 3.0 is it only, it's limited in the sizing. You can use inserts and stuff, I guess. But 27, 21, 24, 24. 19, 17, 15. It's freaking awesome. Okay, so this looks a lot like the Willow, very classic Willow design. The thing about it is, is it is not, you can't pump in any position, right? It's it's designed to use with the containers. So it is very similar to the Willow with the containers. This looks smaller. This looks smaller than the big Willow. And this is smaller. This is the price tag of the Willow Go, which is awesome. So if you're using mostly the reusable bags anyway, um, this is a way more affordable option for you. They also have an insurance option. So you can actually get this through your insurance or you can pay out of pocket either way. Um, it's like a hundred and hundred and something dollars with insurance, which is really cool. Um, it has an app, right? Here you go. Here's what it looks like says that it goes up to 280 mmhg. We will test that for sure. It actually looks really cool. I love the price. I'm not going to lie. And it is small. Fits right in the bra. So when you compare it to the Willow 3.0, which is kind of the other classic Willow um, in bra wearable design, that's pretty easy. These come with five ounce containers. You do have the option to do a bigger seven ounce container, which is a big deal. The, the Willow 3.0, the, the like original, um, only has five ounce containers. So if you're, some of you like to pump a lot, that's a really cool feature. This says two parts to clean. Um, I disagree. I think there's more than two, <laughs> but that's okay. Um, this one's five. This one is a very standard, the, the Go. It's a very standard setup of a pump. Uh, it's got the backflow protector, the valve, the container, so very five parts is like the standard number to clean. I don't know why they say two, but whatever. Um, they both have an app, so this is an app connected. You can't control the pump from this app, but you can track your session. This one you can actually control your pump and track all of that kind of stuff. This one you can switch between modes, expression and stimulation. This one, if you'll remember right, you cannot. That one is like the original 3.0 Willow. There's several videos on my YouTube channel about that one. And that one has the, the standard, the standard sucking of the Willow, which is, which is like, um, it keeps a suction on you. So it holds the nipple in there and it keeps continuous suction, which is why you can use it in any position where you're using the bags, because it is, the suction is, is quite different on the original Willow. The Willow Go is much more like, a normal pump like the LV, LV Stride, um, any kind of collection cups that you use with another pump, the Willow Go is is closer to that, right? So you you are on the move. You have no cords, which is really really cool. Um, uh, so like with the LV Stride that just came out, that was LV's cheaper version, right? You still have those tubes you have to deal with. So I do actually think this one's pretty cool that it's all right in there. It's small and it's cheaper. <laughs> which is awesome. There are a few drawbacks. Like the Willow 3.0 does have some of some cool features. And if you need some of those features, I think it would be a good option. But if you're wanting a more affordable way to be hands-free, um, I mean, it's, this one is still more expensive than like the mom cozy. So like, uh, you know, if you bought two of those, 
or even the Amani pump from Legendary Milk, if you buy two of these, that would still be cheaper than the Willow Go. But the design of this, I mean, you can see just by looking at it, is different than this, right? This is, this is more sleek. It is more discreet. So I'm really interested to try out this new Willow pump and see what it's all about. So as soon as I get it in my hands, I will run a bunch of tests for you, like I always do, and then give you some really non-biased data and feedback on this pump. But for now, I hope that helps you answer a few questions. I will put um, a link here to check that out, but be expecting some more videos soon, as soon as I can get a pump and try it out for you. All right, talk to you later. Bye.